twisted wreckage of an express train lies strewn over the railway track. This was the scene at Whedon, 12 miles south of Rugby, a few hours after the Liverpool to Houston Express plunged down an embankment while travelling at around 60 miles an hour. Eight people were killed immediately. Five more died later in hospital to bring the total casualty roll to 13 dead, 40 injured. The train had been carrying 700 passengers and when the engine crashed down the embankment, it took 10 of the 15 coaches with it. But for the alertness of a signalman, the disaster might have killed many more, for the Glasgow-bound Royal Scot was within two minutes of reaching the derailed express when it was stopped. With both lines blocked, breakdown gangs were at work throughout the weekend to relay the track. An official investigation into the cause of the crash will begin later this week. Miraculously, only two people were killed and eight injured when, near the little town of Whitham in Essex early on Tuesday morning, the Peterborough to London mail train ran into the back of a slow-moving goods train. The engine was thrown on its side after plying for 200 yards through trucks and wagons. potatoes from Scotland had been one of the principal freights carried by the goods train and among the debris and broken iron that littered the track salvage men were at work collecting them. Mobile cranes swung wheels, bogies and shattered coaches to one side. Piece by piece the heavy wreckage was cleared away and after several hours of concentrated work the repair gangs had the line cleared for normal running again.